Hello and welcome to what could be my first uh, Let's Play on YouTube. Alright. So I'm already past the intro screen. Don't worry, you didn't miss anything. The intro just showed that uh, I'm some gamer guy who uh, basically gets thrown around or intercepted by the assassins. And they want me to control these two guys so they can find a piece of Eden or whatever. All the future stuff's irrelevant. We actually just walk right on through. Get the fuck out of my way, kid. These people are a fine bunch. I feel like it would have been a lot darker back then, because, uh... They didn't have a whole lot of lights. I mean, they did. But, uh... They weren't gonna spend money on them, you Lord. kidding me? What do you think you're doing? Whatever. No one goes in or out. Unless there's a problem. I hold the machines. That door opens, and I have my route to Ferris. Cool. We make problems for these fine folk. Truly, who is the villain here? The one who pays wages, or the one that sabotages knowingly? Really a question if these guys are good. Alright. Let's move on through. God damn. Just like the last game. I'm moving quick. And so is that guy's apron. Alright. Okay. One more sabotage. What the? We're never going to make up the time. What the fuck is up with you folk? Is it just me or are these people spazzing like crazy? <laughs> See, look at this. All these people put in danger now. Also, I can open a fucking door. I jumped off of a train through a window so I can walk through a fucking door. This man is dead. You're the dead man. Run along Alright. Kick his butt! You lost your fucking hat! And you lost your balls! Alright. Bring it. Oh. Dude. What's up with throwing their hats around, man? They need those. We're in fucking London, losing your hats like cancer. Kit wrecked. Honestly, I would have loved that they didn't have hidden blade in the middle of those combats. Yeah, I would have the option to make you suck my dick, but uh, unfortunately, I do not. You guys have a good day. Whoa. You, you know... There was a way around that factory. I didn't have to kill anybody. Or ruin anyone's job. What? 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 Are you a mage? He's trying to disarm his mage-like skills by pretending that he hurt himself. I got my eye on you. Nothing cool happened. Let's go. Uh, oh! Yay. Oh-ho! Um, what? Right trigger? Left, left stick. Le Wait, that's... Oh, that's the eagle vision. Okay. B. 
Oh, I had to hold it. Well, hold the phone. He's fucking dead. Jesus. I played video games before, you know. Alright, give me your loot. Fuck you. Spazzy motherfucker. Alrighty. I walked by like nobody saw a damn thing. Which nobody real did, let's be honest. Ferris Ironworks. I'm glad his name's all over the place. Cool. Mm -mm -mm. Take a little jug. I'm sure nobody's gonna see me. Okay. I'm kind of disappointed this never became a thing, but, uh, hold on. But in the old Assassin's Creed's, what they wanted to do was make sensitivity a big part of it. So the harder you held a button would change what action you would do. I'm disappointed that never became the case because I wanted to do a jug, but instead I had to do a full-on sprint. Which is disappointing, since I didn't want to go that fast. Okay. I mean, it's still the same game otherwise. I need that mechanic, man. Let's just go for it. Fuck you! Stealth don't exist! Ow! Dick! You lost your hat! It seems like the source of their powers are a hat. Once they lose it, they can't combat you. Alright. Put my sweet hat back on. Nah. There we go. Don't tell me nobody's gonna notice this, right? Ooh. Really? Nobody? That guy's facing away from me. Sneaking, A, makes him harder to detect and allows you to move faster. The stealth ring shows enemies above and below. From behind cover, hold LT to aim, and press RT to throw knives. Cool, whatever. I'm just gonna ignore everyone. I'm gonna do how I usually do stealth and very poorly. Nope! Peace, motherfucker! Yeah! You can't stop me, boy! Woo! Can't stop the freedom! Oh ho! Everyone's spazzing! Jesus! Oh. Alrighty. I'm gonna end up looking into that uh, spaz thing and realize it's my GPU on fire. We're gonna figure that out before next part. Mr. Ferris, sir. The, uh, the lad in the factory should be taken to be bandaged by the apothecary. Fine. But dock his wages. Yes, sir. What a nice man. He took the kid to an apothecary, at least. The final price was That's the price. How would you know? You had no idea that conversation was happening. Don't you even fucking pretend. Hmm. I mean, I, the player, knew, but I'm beyond you. Unless this game isn't going to Undertale on me. Alright. No, quite the opposite. We're going up. Moving parts. Moving parts. I'm not gonna worry about it. Uh, any of these fools evil? Nope. Hi. Oh, um. Uh, okay. Huh, I took its word for it. I was thinking there was someone right next to him, but... I guess the game wanted me to go this way. 2012 pounds?! Uh, we find a way down, or we find a way across. All right, we go across. Let's go. Oh, so much cooler doing this. Entry point. What? They show me? 
You're telling me I don't have to figure that shit out anymore? It's actually kind of lame. Right. Uh. Yeah! Don't you worry, dear. I saved you from your waging job. I. It is done. Kiss me. Oh? What did you accomplish, boy? A vault loosened in Starrick's machine. A large bolt. But not enough. Your Grandmaster will fall. You assassins can circle London to your heart's content. The mechanism we have built has been going strong for a hundred years. And will run a thousand more. It is the very city itself. We will take London from your hands. From Croydon. You lurk in the shadows like a coward. I doubt it. You should have seen me earlier, buddy. Hey, you got ketchup on your neck. Hey, I'm gonna wash that for you. Jacob's a nice guy. He just cleaned up the ketchup. Not all of it, but... Good job. Good as new. People in London are so nice. Hi. Um, you have to understand? You didn't see a damn thing. Goodbye. I have a train to catch, apparently. Let's go. Can I...